Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to build your own mechanical 7 segment display using an Arduino and micro servos. You'll need to use an Arduino Mega for this project as the Uno only has 6 PWM outputs so you won't even be able to drive a single 7 segment display. The Arduino Mega has 15 PWM outputs so you'll be able to drive two 7 segment displays with it and make up a double digit number. A parts list and links to more detailed instructions are in the video description. I started off by measuring the servos and the servo arms in order to design a green segment to be driven by each servo. I 3D printed the 14 segments using bright green PLA. I printed out one first to try out. I also printed out a small spacer block to support each server on the backboard. Each segment stands directly above the server when visible and is moved 90 degrees to the side when it's not visible. Once I was happy with the design, I 3D printed the other 13 segments. I needed to paint the sides of each segment black so that they're less visible when they're turned away. I sprayed the back and sides of all 14 segments. I then installed the server arms, spacer blocks and segments onto each server. I had to make a servo power harness to power all 14 servos and connect them to the Arduino. The onboard power supply on the Arduino is not strong enough to drive all 14 servos, so I used a 5V battery elimination circuit used for RC aircraft to power them. I cut a small piece of strip board to supply power to the servos and separate the signal inputs. I mapped out the segment numbers to keep track of which was connected to which Arduino input. There are 12 PWM outputs sequentially from 2 to 13 and I then had to use pins 44 and 45 for the remaining two. 
I put a single digit together to get that running first. I had to add some logic into the code to move the two segments adjacent to the middle segment out of the way when it moves so that it doesn't bump into them. Once I was happy with one digit working, I added the second digit and added a few more lines of code to duplicate the digits. In this sketch, I created two arrays to calibrate the on-off positions for each segment, as well as an array to store the segment positions for each digit from 0 to 9. I then assigned the servo pins and set all of the servos to the on position. The main loop then starts, which consists of two main counters, one for each digit, and two smaller counters which control each of the seven segments. I had to add in a few delays to the movements of the segments adjacent to the middle segment so that they didn't bump into each other. Once that was done, I uploaded the code and the countdown was ready to start. Thanks for watching, please remember to like this video and subscribe to my channel for more Arduino builds as well as tech videos, repairs and reviews.